Taekwondo is one of the most widely practiced martial arts across the globe. It's also one of the most scrutinized. It's estimated that around 70 million people practice Taekwondo worldwide, which puts it among other top martial arts like Karate and Judo in terms of popularity. Some believe it is number one in terms of followers. However, as is the case with most things, its popularity is followed by criticism. Taekwondo is widely considered an impractical martial art. Critics claim the sparring system is too sporty and bogged down by rules and regulations that would never work in the street. The self-defense is too choreographed and convenient to be worth learning. The time they spend on stunts, twists, and flips could be better served elsewhere. So what exactly is Taekwondo good for? I'm not here to ignore the critiques and blindly defend the art. In fact, I agree with the assessments I just listed, but I think these are only considered problems in the first place because they are all rooted in the idea that martial arts is expected to turn you into a world-class fighter. That's where my opinion differs. It's unfair to assume that every individual embarks on a journey in martial arts because they want to learn to fight. The five tenets of Taekwondo are courtesy, integrity, perseverance, self-control, and indomitable spirit. These things can, and in my mind should, be practiced without physical altercation. My only concern is that the school is clear about their intent. As long as the students know what they're getting into, there shouldn't be any problem. If someone is interested in fighting, MMA is probably the best place for them, or knockouts or severe injuries are the end goal. So I believe Taekwondo is good for a lot. The beautiful and sharp pumse or forms are a great way to practice the art side of martial arts, and the competitions are fun. Taekwondo sparring is a great sport for coordination, agility, and physical fitness, and is generally a safer way to practice simulated fights, though not as so-called practical. Weapons training is hand-eye coordination. Board and brick breaking is a demonstration of power and conditioning developed over time. And the flexibility in Taekwondo is unmatched as seen in their kicks. But as I always like to say, we need to examine why we're doing these things as opposed to just what we're doing. It is totally fine for a Taekwondo practitioner to learn these physical feats for fun and their own betterment instead of for a fight that may or may not happen, as long as they're aware that that is their goal. I totally understand why Taekwondo is looked down upon. I just hope this video can help us better understand our differences. To me, martial arts is neither a fighting style nor a sport, but a way of life. Thanks for watching.